We've climbed the highest mountains, crossed oceans, and built the tallest buildings. There's no denying that humans have achieved some pretty impressive things in their time. Now, we're taking our very bodies and using them to run these 10 unbelievable human-powered machines. Before we get started, make sure you hit that like button. Also, subscribe to our channel and turn on notifications so you can keep up to date with all our latest and most exciting content. Be sure to stay till the end of the video to check out our number one pick. Number 10, Wow Katonga Velomobile. First up on our list is a machine that you'd be surprised to learn is human powered. It may look like a high-tech racing car or some sort of prototype space shuttle, but the Wow Katonga Velomobile is a seriously stylish recumbent bicycle. The Wow Katonga Velomobile's sleek race car-like appearance isn't just for show though. By taking advantage of advanced aerodynamics, this recumbent bicycle is able to achieve speeds far in excess of a standard bike. It also requires as little as a quarter of the energy you use to pedal a traditional bike. Not only is the Wow Katanga Velomobile capable of increased speed, but the unique design is significantly more comfortable than traditional road bikes thanks to the improved conception. The Wow Katanga Velomobile has also been designed to be super easy to repair making it an affordable alternative to a car for short distance commuting and basic shopping trips. Need a little more power? The Wow Katanga Velomobile has the option to add electrical assistance for even greater levels of performance. Number nine, Scoopster Pedal Sub. Not all human powered machines are stuck within the confines of land-based travel. The Scoopster Pedal Sub is a one-man submersible vehicle which allows for some serious underwater exploration. The Scoopster Pedal Sub takes the dream of undersea adventuring and presents it in a fun little bright yellow package. It's not all for show though, and this mini submarine can head on down to impressive depths of up to 20 feet. There's no need to worry about air supply, as the Scoopster Pedal Sub uses a scuba mask and tank to provide much needed oxygen, meaning that even if you were to end up with a bit of a leak, you'd still be fine. Built in the luxurious and sun-drenched south of France, the Scoopster Pedal Sub was invented by French engineer Stéphane Rousson. The Scoopster Pedal Sub might rely on the efforts of the single occupant to build up momentum, but that doesn't stop it from cutting through the waves at a very respectable rate of 5 miles per hour. Number 8. Atlas Helicopter While you may not be taking it on a long-haul flight anytime soon, the next machine on our list represents an incredible breakthrough in human achievement. The Atlas Helicopter is the first helicopter to achieve purely man-powered flight. This insane machine was built to participate in the Igor I. Sikorsky Human-Powered Helicopter Competition and was the first ever to win the prize, the objective of which was to reach 10 feet of altitude for at least 60 seconds with a purely human-powered helicopter. On the 13th of June 2013, the Atlas Helicopter achieved this momentous goal with a flight lasting 64 seconds and reaching a height of almost 11 feet. The Atlas helicopter was created by AeroVelo, an aerospace industry engineering company founded by two graduates of the University of Toronto. They funded this project using money created from the crowdfunding platform Kickstarter, raising over $34,000 towards the goal of creating a man-powered helicopter. Number 7. ELF There's no denying that cycling is considerably more eco-friendly than driving a car. But it's not always practical to take a bike, especially when you have things to carry or the weather turns bad. The ELF is a new type of vehicle that aims to find the middle ground between bicycle and automobile in the most environmentally friendly way possible. The ELF relies on pedal power to produce most of its get up and go, but provides electric drive motor assistance for increased speed and a lighter workload on your legs. The electric drive system is charged via an integrated solar panel that's built into the roof ensuring that your ELF remains fully charged at all times. While the ELF will save you money over the long term with its eco-friendly approach to transportation, you'll need to make a reasonable upfront investment to purchase one of these electric bike cars, as it starts at around $9,000 for the base model. Number 6. Archaeopteryx Electroglider The power of flight has long been an obsession of humankind, and it's easy to see why. There's a certain power that you feel as you drift high above the ground and look down upon society. The Archaeopteryx Electroglider takes the power of flight and puts it into your hands with this incredible single pilot aircraft. Launching the Archaeopteryx Electroglider is as simple as getting a solid run-up off an appropriate inclined slope. 
the enormous aerodynamic glider wings are fully capable of taking over from there. The Archaeopteryx Electroglider can cruise comfortably at speeds of 35 miles per hour, but features a top speed of 81 miles per hour. An electrically powered motor allows you to increase your in-air flight time if you'd rather not just rely on the power of your own two feet. Swiss manufacturer Ruppert has built less than 20 units of this machine. And of course, all good things come at a price. The Archaeopteryx Electroglider will cost you a decent chunk of cash to purchase. This tiny aircraft packs a $100,000 price tag. Number 5. Schwieb Racer If you love theme parks and all the fun rides that come along with them, our next human-powered machine is going to be right up your alley. The Schwieb Racer takes the concept of a recumbent bike and turns it into a race to the finish line across a high-speed monorail track. The Schwieb Racer pits two racers head-to-head -head in a three-lap circuit of the 200-meter monorail track. The two tracks run parallel and even cross over at times for an adrenaline rush inducing contest of speed and endurance. Compete against your family and friends to see who can achieve the fastest lap times and claim the crown of racing champion. While the individual pods may not look especially sophisticated or fast, they're capable of reaching top speeds of up to 30 miles per hour if the pilot really pedals hard. The Schwieb Racer is a totally unique concept created by Velocity Valley Rotorua Adventure Park. In fact, it's the only pedal-powered monorail system on the planet. Number 4. Tanivois Submarine Another attempt to take the concept of submersible vehicles and apply human power to their operation is the Tanivois Submarine. This incredibly small sub focuses more on speed in the water than explorational abilities. At 3 meters in length and weighing just 60 kilograms, the Tanivois submarine doesn't waste any weight on extraneous nonsense. A pilot powers the vehicle from inside by pedaling, which in turn powers the fish-like fins and propels the submarine through the water. No slouch in the water, the Tanivois submarine claimed the world record for the fastest fin-driven submarine, and just narrowly missed out on the record for non-propeller submarines. It can achieve top speeds of up to 4.2 miles per hour. Not bad for what is essentially an underwater bike. The Tanivois submarine was designed by students at the University of Auckland in New Zealand. It takes three years to go from inception to completed product. While it's currently just a prototype project with race speed in mind, professors hope the technology used to power the fins can have other applications in submersible vehicles down the line. Number 3. Snowbird Ornithopter Another human-powered flight machine from Aerovelo is the Snowbird Ornithopter. This incredible machine is the first ever human-powered ornithopter to successfully achieve the marvel of flight. For those of you that don't know what an ornithopter is, it's essentially an aircraft that attempts to imitate the way birds are able to fly by flapping enormous wings. Modern methods of flight have surpassed this concept due to its inefficiency, but it still represents an interesting curiosity to the world of aviation. The Snowbird Ornithopter was able to sustain both altitude and airspeed for an astonishing 19.3 seconds. Constructed by Arabello while they were still students at the University of Toronto, the Snowbird Ornithopter represents an incredible achievement in aerospace engineering. The project began conception as early as 2006, but it would not be until 2010 that the successful flight would take place. Aerovelo have now gone on to produce various other human-powered machines and constantly seek to innovate within this space. Number 2. Swin Car We've seen a lot of interesting land-based machines in this list, but most of them haven't been capable of dealing with incredibly rough conditions or uneven terrain. Swin Car is one of the most extraordinary all-terrain vehicles ever to be released on the market. Designed and manufactured in France, the Swin Car was created to sweep across the French countryside with a level of grace not seen before in ATVs. The dynamic suspension system is the heart of the Swin Car driving experience. A high-tech array of gyroscopes and sensors meld with electric motors and hydraulics to allow the Swin Car to cross over the lumpiest and uneven ground so effortlessly that it looks like magic. The Swin Car suspends the driver centrally within the frame of the vehicle. It takes advantage of the driver's center of gravity to increase stability both on and off-road. When you consider all of the technology that goes into producing the Swin Car, it's actually quite reasonably priced. You can expect to pay around $15,000 for the base model. Number 1. Walking Bike 
Last up on our list is a form of transportation that may earn you more than a few strange looks if you were to take it out in public. The walking bike substitutes the rear wheel with a complex looking mechanical system that actually uses legs to literally walk. That's right, a bike with real working legs. The walking bike draws inspiration from the works of Dutch artist Theo Janssen, who reached critical acclaim for his wind-powered walking strand beast sculptures. Eight months of research and prototyping went into the creation of the walking bike. There are more than 400 bespoke-made components involved in its construction. The walking bike made its debut at the 2015 Santa Barbara Solstice Parade, where its creators received a great deal of curiosity and praise for their bizarre-looking invention. It doesn't matter where in the world you take the walking bike, you're sure to draw the eyes of passers-by and elicit more than a few comments. And that's 10 unbelievable human-powered machines. If you enjoyed this video, please give us a like and let us know in the comments what you think. Check out our other videos and subscribe to be part of the fun. Click on the notification icon so you can see our new videos as soon as they're uploaded. That's it for now.